Thanks for joining us here in Geneva for the AI for Good Global Summit 2018. My guest today is Abhishek Gupta. He is an AI and ethics researcher at McGill University and District 3. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you for having me. It's my pleasure. So your work, Mr. Gupta, focuses very much on finding ways to include ethics in the development of AI. Tell us more about it. So yeah, uh, I actually founded this uh, community, the Montreal AI Ethics Community, uh, that has grown uh, since last year to more than 700 people. And you know, these are people really coming from the most diverse set of backgrounds that you could think about. So law, sociology, anthropology, machine learning PhDs, people coming from bioethics, neuroscience, policy makers, and, and the list goes on. And these are people who are uh, your average everyday citizens. So you know, they, they span the course of you know, uh, students, people who are early career professionals, people who've been in the industry for many, many decades. And the goal is for all of them to come together and contribute their views and their concerns and their insights into what can constitute the ethical development of AI. And when it comes to the ethical development of AI, it's very important, just like we'd, what we're trying to do here, to include all the stakeholders. Exactly. Uh, I mean, inclusivity is, is one of the core pillars for the ethical development of AI. We really need to be able to capture all of the insights that come from people who would traditionally be uh, not able to participate in, in you know, different uh, conversations that happen around uh, you know, the development of AI, the regulations, the practices that are taking place around the world. So how important was it for you as an individual, but also as a, as a delegate of, the, uh, of, of Canada to be here to represent your, your, your research? Sorry, I'm going to do that one again. I'm going in 200 directions. Okay. No so you're here at the summit uh, as an individual, obviously, but also as a representative of all the Canadians working uh, on this topic on ethical development of AI. Yeah, exactly. So I'm actually here as the uh, lead for the Canadian delegation, and it spans organizations and companies coming from Vancouver, from Montreal, from Toronto, from Waterloo, from Ottawa. And, and the goal really is, because not everyone can attend, so what I've done is captured their insights, their concerns, and you know their ideas that they wanted to bring to the summit, and to uh, you know share them with the attendees of the summit, and then to take the discussions that we have here back to Canada and share them back with all of the uh, you know participants of this delegation. And what would you say are the main concerns when it comes to the ethical development of AI? So I think so, you know, some of the biggest concerns are around uh, the issues of bias, the issues of inclusivity, the issues of fairness, interpretability is another big issue. And you know, they're both at a technical and at a policy level. Uh, you know, there are some things that we can address through technology, but there are a lot of other things that you know, happen at a policy level, happen at a citizen participation level, because we need you know, people to voice what it is that they foresee as their relationship with these AI systems so that they can uh, you know, meaningfully contribute to the development of these systems. You were here last year yeah. already for the launch of the uh, summit. Um, how have things changed compared to last year? So, you know, I think the change has happened in sort of two directions. One, in the way that uh, the entire community since then uh, globally has become more aware of these issues of, you know, have one using AI for good, but also, uh, you know, some of the ethical concerns that arise when you use autonomous systems. So things that are, you know, don't necessarily have hum uh, humans in the loop. The other thing is that the summit has moved from, uh, you know, discussions and educating the attendees to, inviting participation from the attendees through concrete projects. So that's something that I've been very excited about because that was you know, the change for me coming from last year to this year, that I would have the opportunity to share some of these insights and to actually work with people on concrete projects that hopefully can make an impact. Abhishek Gupta, thank you very much. Thank you.